Hello YouTube, it's dbest one and we're back again. And I just wanted to unbox my new seat that I got from uh, ED Seats. E's and Eddie, D's and David. Um, motorcycle seats. And their website is edusa.com. And I had a Mustang seat on a V-Star 1300 before this. And I was just fully unhappy with it. If you're riding shorter than 90 miles, then it's not that bad. But if you're going any further than that, if you're going, um, you know, 100 miles, two, 300 mile, 300 mile ride, forget about it. You're going to be hurting. I was hurting. Forget about it. I ride to Vermont. I was dying. Anyway, so uh, long story short, a little searching around. A lot of people recommended the uh, ED seats, and I decided to pick one up. Anyway, so we get to opening it, and let's see how it is. I don't do unboxes unboxing very much, but uh, I I haven't been putting up too many videos, so I figured, hey, you know, I figured why not? Because it's not very often that I'm getting to put videos up n nowadays, so um, I figured while I can. I put something up. Now I got a long ride coming up all the way down to South Carolina and uh, I tell you I really really wanted something that would be comfortable for that ride and I called up ED Mike at the ED seats and spoke to him and he recommended the big Torrent seat which is as you can see here and I also got the backrest too so wow beautiful I'm <laughs> a big sucker too man you can pretty much see here what it looks like you have the little curvature here and then you have your seat it's the side and then here is the backrest that goes along with it. Get that out. And that's the backrest. I guess you have to disinstalls. Hmm. Well, we'll look into that. I'll try and figure that out how that works. But this goes in there somewhere. Oh, I guess it just goes in here. What's the bolt for? Oh, okay. It just inserts right in there. And I guess the screw is this is your adjustment point. I I could assume, yeah. That's your adjustment point, your stopping point, I guess. Okay. Cool deal. That's pretty much that's pretty much what it'll end up looking like. All right, let's put it on a bike. Be right back. All right, YouTube. So we are back, and here is my stock seat configuration. Let me just pull this tripod leg up. So here's my stock seat configuration. As you can see here, that's my new Cobra intake I just put on. I gotta get the k and washer though. Uh, so here's a stock seat as it is. That was a setup that I had um, or have. And using the Airhawk, ultimate rear seat for the wife. And so now I will put the I will put the ultimate on there. And I will be right back again. All right, YouTube, we're back again. So, man, the the the, the fitment was super easy. All I had to do, you put the key. If it, it's just like stock, I just made sure the metal tab was in there underneath the little latch that's in the back. Put the key in slide it back pushed it down and it was like just like putting in just like putting in a stock seat just amazing um didn't sit on it yet i'm gonna do that in a second all right let's sit on it without the uh the back rest all right we'll do that first let's sit on it let's see what it feels like oh wow that's nice I'm like pretty much 
in the same position that I was in stock, where the seat was stock. I feel, I, I feel as though I'm in the same position. Yep, pretty much, same position, where I can stretch my feet out, have my feet right on the highway pegs. I don't even know if we can see that. Let me turn the thing around, because you may not be able to see. And if you notice that, the, uh, can you see? Yeah, you can see the saddlebag, okay. You can see my foot on the highway peg. Okay, good, yeah. Headrest fits in the saddlebag. Easily, very nicely. Anyway, but. Oh, oh, oh man, that's beautiful. That's just beautiful. Gotta love it. That's nice. I'm in love with that seat. Put the backrest in. I guess it would take, probably take a while, a few rides for me to, has a little bit of Velcro here so you can scoop that down. Scoot it down right under the seat there and then that's it. Nighttime, you're putting the bike away, you're going inside. If you're parked at the hotel, you take the backrest out, throw the backrest in, uh, in your, uh, your what you call it? in your suitcase okay. so you can adjust your you can adjust how far back that goes based on where you want it so if you want it a little further up to have it a little further up basically wherever you feel that you want it I'll put it a little further I'll put it so it rests a little further back like that that's what that looks like you see your passengers getting on you just fold it forward just fold it forward put it up EDC big Torin. Uh, EDC right big tour yeah the big Torin. if I'm not mistaken that's what it's called big Torin, big riding Torin. the big Torin seat I love it man I'm 5'11", 240, so um, we're going to see how this does in the long run. Hope for the best. I'm happy. All right, YouTube. Thank you for watching again. And uh, you guys ride safe, be safe, and enjoy yourselves.